Meantime, at the other side, Pertamina claimed to have taken a series of efficiency and optimizing costs as much as $2.2 billion or equivalent to 32 trillion rupiah until the second year of this COVID-19 pandemic. Previously, the President Joko Widodo criticized the corporation to do an efficiency and not rely on subsidies only. Responding to President Jokowi's direction, the temporary officer, Vice President Corporate Communication Pertamina, Happy Wulansari, say that Pertamina has done trillions of efficiencies. From the cost saving program of 20 trillion rupiah, cost avoidance of 5 trillion rupiah, also additional revenue growth of 7 trillion rupiah. All of those innovations are done in the middle of the dynamic of the crude palm oil. And still, Pertamina survived to records net profit of 29.3 trillion in 2021. Happy aided in the upstream sector, Pertamina was able to optimize production costs and services through the budget tolerance profile, optimization of well interventions, until the savings of chemical consumption and fuel use. With it, Pertamina has successfully saved 4 trillion rupiah.